Hey guys, how are you? I have a family dollar haul. And somebody got me in trouble with this one. They were in an enabler. Because there was something that I wanted and I couldn't find it. And I told myself I quit. I'm not looking again. And um, we went to Dollar General. Um, that's, well, I wouldn't say way up the road. But it's a little drive. Like in a little bit in like farm area. And so I don't know if I saw her picture before Dollar General or after but I told Eric I was like can you take me home because I want to get in my car and find this item and then Eric was like you know where do you want to go and I'm like I want to go up the highway to go to Family Dollar and then he reminded me that there was the new Family Dollar well it's new to us basically was it a Dollar General or Dollar Tree no if it was a Dollar Tree I think it would still be there it was some kind of dollar store some kind of, you know, dollar-ish store, and we never went in there. I don't know if it was a Dollar General. I don't know. But anyway, they closed down, and then found the dollar went in it. So, I'm going to save the last things for last, and I'll save at the end to got me in trouble. Because their picture really enticed me and brought out the cuteness, you know, in the item and, and, and brought my love back for it. Okay, so the first thing I found, and I'm going to put my seeds in here. And hopefully I can freeze this and stuff my seeds in. But it just says rectangle storage clip lock. What? Oh, I thought you said watch for something. I'm like, he's coming. And it was only a dollar. They had this color. And if they had another one of these, I would have got this color. And then they had a dark purple. But I like this because I can see through it and everybody can see what's in it. And then I don't know why the Sam's heck I got these, but I did. Bag clips. I always need a bag clip, so I thought maybe... You know, like for my cat treats, sometimes you can't get in the stupid bag and you rip the, you know, plastic. Or sometimes I have a bag of candy and then I've got to leave it open. So this way I'll just leave these in my room. These were $2. And I hemmed and hauled. And then, the, I don't know, the cuteness of the cactuses just got me. So I got them. And then I found, I do have something in here I can't show you because I'm sending it to a friend. Um, but I found these new color and I'm wishing I would have gotten her one of these. But this is in the pink lemonade scent. Isn't that cute? These were $2. And I already opened up the strawberry one. And they have like, I mean for $2, that's not bad for these. And then you undo them and that's what they look like. They have a faint, a, this one has a faint, a faint scent of strawberry, but I'm so tickled that it has the faint scent and it actually smells like if you took and smelled a real strawberry, that's what this smells like. Okay. And then, yeah, here's the item I can't show you. Okay. And then this one is the same, the new color, and this one is orange. Now, usually with orange, whether it's in markers or whatever, orange just does not have a smell. It's just bananas, and I don't understand it. It just says orange scented, so there's no, like, flavor. This one I didn't, I don't know if you can see, like, the little diamonds or the little, whatever you call those kind of markings in it. Ooh. Oh, my gosh. Smell that. Can you smell it? Oh my gosh, y'all. I want to eat this. It smells... Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I did show you. It smells like... Um, oh, gosh. <laughs> creamsicle. This smells like creamsicle. Made me a liar. This company kicks tail. Awesome. Okay, then we're going to... I already showed you this one. We're going to open it. Pink Lemonade. Well, that, that one, the, um, the strawberry one already wore off. Oh, wow. Oh, this company kicks ass. I'm sorry, but it, it's amazing. These are made in China. Good job, China. And they are so cute. Like, you have to spend a lot of money. Look at her hair. That's what my Aunt Peggy should do. So, yep, got those. Okay. So I have to, um, well, the one, not the other, because I found the one first. So, okay, let me tell you this. I'm, I'm going to get all excited. I'm not going to make no sense. So we went through the whole store, okay?
okay the whole cotton picking store and only the reason why I found these lippy things the only reason why I found those is because I went looking for the um, for the chap is it by chapstick the chapstick the mint one because the one I have is not the mint that I know as a child and it just did not taste right so we so we looked through the whole store and I was so discouraged because I'm like here we are again we did not find it and this is like the fourth time that I've been in Family Dollar so we went okay now the whole reason why let me let me just go ahead and say that I should have said in the beginning but Creative Chica Miss Tony, y'all know her. I know darn well everybody on my channel should know her. But if you don't check her out, she's amazing. She does all kinds of videos. Um, you name it, all kinds. Dollar Tree, Michaels, Walmart, let me think. Um, she does shout outs, um, giveaways. But you know, she's just awesome. I, I before her giveaways, I knew her before her giveaways, and I just I loved her her sassy spunky spirit I just I was drawn to that and I'm like she's one cool chick too bad she lives so far away though but she had posted a picture of the second one that I'm gonna show you but this is the one that I found first this one and I thought these were bigger but because of her picture of the second one that I got um, and thank you so much dear because you said you were gonna if you found one you were gonna get me one and that was very sweet of you um, but I found these ones and when I found these and I could not believe they were only three dollars because I didn't know the price I never even paid attention to the price and I wasn't going to get the unicorns but I thought you know what we drove all the way up here dag on it I think I talked to myself if I saw them I'm like you know what we're going to go ahead and get them so I got the unicorn salt and pepper shakers and the SKU number if it helps anybody is 698583 the barcode so they have a SKU number up here and now I'm going to read you the barcode is 192598266989. That's the whole barcode. So aren't they sexy looking? Then I saw this box and all I saw was this. Now I didn't see this right away. There's this whole bin. Would you say they were black? Yeah. Black box bins kind of uh, like in the middle of the store. Stores. When I, when everybody has been hauling these, oh look, these are, oh, I guess because they're bigger faces. Yeah. Look, they're not even the same size box. Um, I saw this one laying down like this, so all I saw was the top of the box, and this was at the end of these long boxes, right? And, um, when I, and I wasn't even going to flip it over. I didn't even notice that it had flipping donuts all over it. I just saw that it had this pattern. Oh, cool, I can take that off and then maybe... Um, but anyway, look, I found them, y'all. I found them darn things. Okay, the SKU number for these, the the, the donut, is uh, 698583. Is that the same number as the unicorns? 698... Yeah, it's the same number. And then let me see, is the uh, barcode... Nine, eight, nine, what? Nine. No, I'm looking up here. Six nine eight. Yeah, it's got the same skew. Let me see. I'll just read you the area code. I mean the area code. Good lord. No, the skew number is different. So the long skew number is one nine two five nine eight two six six nine nine six. And I got these. Thank you, Miss Tony, for your picture. Because if it wasn't for your picture, I wouldn't have came all the way, you know, to where we had to go and get these. But this, the both of these, unless they had these little suckers somewhere else. Both of these were the last ones. I could not find any more of these, did not see any more of these, and they must have been in that little special box bin because everybody else, when they're showing, I seen this picture a long time ago on Instagram, and I kept looking and looking and looking. And then I just finally, you know, gave up. So I was like, yep. But I was super, I was super excited. Okay, guys, I'm going to get off of here. That's all I got at uh, Family Dollar. And um, oh, where do we get these at? No, we got those at um, Dollar General. So that is my Family Dollar haul. We don't have one um, to... That one was probably, what, 30 minutes? A 30-minute drive? Because that one was near the... Um, minute drive. The way you drive, it was probably 40. 
I'm closer to doing. If they're 65, I do close to 70. This one does like 55. And you can do 65. So, oh, no, that's my... Oh, we don't have ice cream, do we? You know what? I should do a Safeway haul, guys. Because I've never done a grocery store haul. So let me get uh, off of here. And I'm going to come back and do my grocery store haul. Oh. Okay? I will see you guys later. Bye.